For many years, Bill, a prominent scientist, has been captivating audiences with his groundbreaking revelations and the mysteries they unlock. Bill N9 has ignited our fascination with the final frontier, unveiling its complex secrets as he guides us through the endless expanse of space that envelopes us and extends infinitely above. Recently, Bill N has unveiled remarkable new images captured by the James Webb Telescope, granting us a rare opportunity to peer into the cosmos as it appeared over 13 billion years ago. These discoveries profoundly challenge our understanding of the universe and reshape our perspectives on the nature of life itself. The telescope is uncovering new wonders about far-off planets, galaxies, and more. This scientific marvel represents a major advancement in space exploration and serves as a worthy successor to the Hubble Space Telescope. But what makes the Webb Telescope's latest images so extraordinary, surpassing our previous expectations and theories, and what insights does Bill and offer regarding them? The Webb Telescope's creation resulted from years of collaboration among NASA scientists and engineers, culminating in its launch on Christmas Day, 2021. Over the ensuing months, its deployment went smoothly. By the end of June 2022, researchers had begun to identify thousands of galaxies, some older and more distant than anything previously discovered. Certain galaxies observed by Webb may have formed 150 million years before the oldest galaxies recorded by Hubble. Furthermore, the Webb telescope is capable of gathering enough light from distant celestial bodies, including exoplanets and stars, to analyze their composition and movement through space. According to Bill N., this data is already revealing intricate details about the atmospheres of planets light years away from Earth, offering insights into the potential for life on these planets, as we understand it. One of the Hubble telescope's most iconic images has been the pillars of creation in the Eagle Nebula. These structures were visible through Hubble's optical capabilities, but the processes taking place within them were not. The Webb telescope's infrared imaging, however, has captured the star formation process within these pillars, revealing clusters of dust and gas much larger than our solar system. These appear as small red dots within the pillars, representing stars still in formation. Bill N. explains that these stars are not yet fusing hydrogen. However, as more material accumulates at the star's center, the pressure increases, triggering a sudden rise in temperature to about 2 million degrees Celsius, which causes hydrogen fusion to begin. The color variations in the image reflect infrared wavelengths, which are mostly invisible to the human eye, while the blue portions are visible light. The increased red radiation is due to the fact that these protostars emit radiation at wavelengths much longer than those detectable by our eyes. Bill N. notes that this image not only highlights the Webb Telescope's infrared capabilities but also provides a snapshot of how stars like our Sun are born. Exoplanets, first detected in the 1990s, have since been found in great numbers. Over 3,000 confirmed planets orbiting distant stars. However, only a few of these exoplanets have been directly imaged. Most of these planets are too far away to be seen, detected only when the light from their host stars is blocked. The first direct image of an exoplanet was captured in September of last year. This planet, known as HIP 65426b, was first identified in 2017. To observe it, scientists used chronographs to block the light from its central star and employ two of the Webb telescope's cameras, along with a series of filters and other instruments. This planet is particularly visible for several reasons. In addition to the Webb Telescope's exceptional infrared sensitivity, the planet orbits its star from a distance 100 times greater than the distance between Earth and the Sun. It is also an enormous gas giant, approximately 12 times the size of Jupiter. Although the ghost galaxy is difficult to observe directly, its brightness can be captured, particularly with the help of infrared imaging. Its spiral structure and the stars extending from its bright center are visible in optical images of M74. However, a recent web image reveals intricate structures resembling threads of heat-emitting dust and gas emanating from the galaxy's center, displayed in vibrant electric blue. 
This new image will help astronomers investigate star-forming regions along the galaxy's spiral arms. A combination of images from both the Hubble and Webb Space Telescopes has produced a breathtaking composite, which displays both optical and infrared views of the galaxy. This composite image was created by researchers from the European Space Agency, ESA, as part of the FANGS project, an international initiative that utilizes Hubble, Webb, and several ground-based telescopes to study 19 nearby galaxies in infrared. Webb's sharp observations at longer wavelengths will enable astronomers to pinpoint star-forming regions in distant galaxies, measure the mass and age of star clusters, and examine the tiny dust particles drifting through interstellar space. In one striking image from July last year, the Webb telescope captured a distant star, Wolfray at 140. This image revealed a recognizable diffraction pattern, a common feature in optical images. Yet, the star was also surrounded by an unusual arrangement of wavy rings, forming a shape that resembles a slightly squared pattern. These rings, unlike the diffraction pattern, are typical of massive Wolfrayet stars, which are in the final stages of their life and have already expelled much of their hydrogen. The interaction between Wolfrayet 140 and its smaller companion star is responsible for creating these distinctive ring structures. The Webb Telescope is designed to observe the most distant galaxies in the universe. In mid-December of the previous year, scientists announced the discovery of four of the oldest known galaxies, the oldest of which were detected for the first time by Webb. These galaxies date back to 13.4 billion years ago, when the universe was only 350 million years old, about 2% of its current age. Initially thought to be among the oldest galaxies in existence, these four galaxies were similar to others Webb has uncovered. By utilizing the telescope's near-infrared spectrograph, researchers were able to determine the galaxy's ages as part of the JADES project. This process uses the redshift of galaxies, caused by the expansion of the universe, to measure their distance. The largest redshift recorded was 13.2, making these galaxies farther away than scientists ever anticipated. With Webb, we are now able to locate galaxies from the early universe and confirm their distances using spectroscopic techniques. Meanwhile, the Webb telescope has been extensively studying an exoplanet in the Virgo constellation. This planet, WASP-39b, lies 700 light-years away and orbits its star much closer than Mercury orbits the Sun. It is a gas giant, about the size of Saturn, and its atmosphere is filled with thick clouds containing sulfur and silicates, including sulfur dioxide. Using two of Webb's spectrographs, researchers were able to detect the presence of carbon dioxide in its atmosphere. If you found this video insightful, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. The continued study of exoplanet WASP-39b has provided valuable insights into its atmospheric composition and structure. Researchers have used the Webb Telescope's advanced infrared capabilities to analyze the planet's thick, sulfur-laden clouds, marking a significant step forward in our understanding of distant worlds. WASP-39b is a prime example of how the Webb Telescope is transforming our ability to study exoplanets in unprecedented detail. This planet's proximity to its host star, combined with its unique atmospheric characteristics, makes it an ideal target for research into planetary atmospheres, especially in relation to the potential for habitability or the existence of life forms in distant solar systems. WASP-39b's atmosphere, with its distinct sulfur compounds, is not the only notable feature. The planet also provides an opportunity for scientists to examine how exoplanets with extreme atmospheric conditions form and evolve. Understanding planets like WASP-39b helps broaden the scope of what we consider potentially habitable, allowing researchers to refine their methods of detecting life-sustaining environments on other exoplanets. In addition to WASP-39b, Webb's capabilities have been instrumental in analyzing the atmospheres of a variety of other exoplanets. The telescope's near-infrared spectrometer has enabled the detection of key molecules in the atmospheres of distant worlds. 
These include water vapor, methane, and carbon dioxide, gases that, when found in certain proportions, can suggest the possibility of life or at least a habitable environment. As Webb continues to monitor the skies, these discoveries will play a key role in guiding future missions aimed at detecting signs of life beyond Earth. The Webb telescope's powerful instruments also allow it to capture detailed images of distant star systems, galaxies, and nebulae, revealing aspects of the universe that were previously beyond our reach. Its ability to observe in infrared light enables it to see through cosmic dust clouds and peer into regions of space that optical telescopes cannot. This is particularly important for studying areas like star-forming regions, where new stars and planets are born. Webb's observations of these regions are offering new insights into how stars and planetary systems come into existence. One of the telescope's most remarkable images captured the Carina Nebula, a stunning region of space where massive stars are forming. The nebula is located around 7,600 light-years from Earth and is one of the most active stellar nurseries in our galaxy. Webb's infrared observations have revealed incredible details about this nebula, including hidden structures that were previously obscured by dust. These findings not only enhance our understanding of star formation but also provide clues about the conditions necessary for life to develop in these distant, star-forming regions. Another area of great interest to astronomers using Webb is the study of supermassive black holes. These mysterious objects, which reside at the centers of many galaxies, are known for their immense gravitational pull. Webb's ability to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths is helping researchers study the environments around these black holes with greater precision. By observing the way matter behaves as it gets pulled toward these cosmic giants, scientists hope to answer key questions about the nature of black holes and their role in galaxy formation. Webb's ability to detect the faintest signals from the farthest reaches of the universe also makes it an invaluable tool for studying the early universe itself. One of its most exciting goals is to capture light from the earliest galaxies that formed just after the Big Bang. These ancient galaxies provide a glimpse into the conditions that existed in the universe's infancy. Webb's observations are already rewriting our understanding of how galaxies formed and evolved over billions of years. The telescope's ability to study these distant galaxies with greater detail will shed new light on the processes that led to the creation of stars, galaxies, and planetary systems. As Webb continues to make groundbreaking discoveries, it is becoming increasingly clear that this new telescope will have a lasting impact on our understanding of the cosmos. Its ability to capture images and data from the farthest reaches of space is transforming the way we explore the universe. By studying distant galaxies, stars, and exoplanets, Webb is helping to answer some of the most profound questions about the origins of the universe, the possibility of life beyond Earth, and the fundamental laws of physics. As Bill N. continues to guide us through these extraordinary discoveries, his insights into the workings of the universe help us appreciate the vastness and complexity of the cosmos. His work highlights the importance of scientific exploration and the value of pushing the boundaries of what we know. With each new discovery made by the Webb Telescope, we are reminded of the endless possibilities that lie ahead in our quest to understand the universe. The Webb Telescope, with its unprecedented capabilities, is not only expanding our knowledge of space but also inspiring a new generation of scientists and explorers. Its discoveries have captured the public's imagination and sparked a renewed interest in space exploration. As we continue to uncover the mysteries of the universe, we are reminded that the final frontier is not just a place to explore, but a source of infinite wonder and inspiration for all of humanity. Bill N's work and the advancements brought about by the James Webb Space Telescope are reshaping the future of space exploration, and as more revelations unfold, we can only imagine the new frontiers of knowledge that await. From uncovering the secrets of distant galaxies to analyzing the atmospheres of exoplanets, the possibilities for scientific discovery are limitless. The Webb Telescope is not just a tool for astronomers, it is a beacon of humanity's endless curiosity and our desire to understand the universe around us. 
As we venture into the unknown, one thing is clear. The journey has only just begun.